I'm Joey Handsome, and you're watching Expatriarch Generations. It's a series in which established Berliner artists select a newcomer to support and promote, kind of mentor, and ultimately play a gig together at Schwitz. For this edition, I've chosen Aria Negrot. She was known as a member of Hercules and Love Affair, and she's an amazing solo artist as well, a vocalist and a producer and stage performer. And for her newcomer, she has selected Longopus. You can catch them May 15th at Schwitz. <laughs> So welcome to the world of Longopus, <laughs> my dear friend Mark, with whom I'm going to talk a little bit why actually we decided to go on this long journey of experimentation with music. <laughs> oh. Well, you're, you're a solo powerhouse of your own. What, what do you prefer? Do you, do you prefer the solo at work? Or? Um, I, I love the solo work. I love to sing. That's my main, uh, my main uh, focus. I produce also a lot, but I'm mostly lately focusing on working on like uh, with other people as well or the vocalists. And I've been doing some remixes that also gives me, it's a lot of fun. It's a completely different thing, uh, but it's definitely a lot of fun. So did you learn the equipment and the software and the engineering aspects? Is that self-taught? Is that just learning by doing for you and, and seeing what's working and what's not? I mean, the magic, the magic of uh, working with music and what many professionals will tell you at some point is that, of course, there is a lot of technical knowledge that you, you can embrace, that there is a lot of technique that you only learn along with years and with study. But if it sounds good... Go with it. Yeah. <laughs> you want to keep your dream alive, but you're working another job, so you've got limited free time. Mm. How do you maintain that focus on your music when you know you've just got these two days, this is your weekend, and you still have to do your laundry and you still have to do this and that and then I have to be creative in this moment. Like, how do you turn it on? Every creative process has its limited time. You know, sometimes it's like three days and you don't sleep. Mm -hmm. You know, like you're just with this idea and you go and sleep three hours and go back because you're so excited. Um, and there is also um, the situation that, of course, when you have a normal life, which we all do, um, you just have to prioritize. And sometimes you're selling furniture and thinking of, it's time for the percolator. It's time for the percolator. It's time for the percolator. Yeah. So you have to kind of like, you know, serve furniture. And, um, and kind of like condense all those thoughts to when the moment you come home, instead of having a shower or, or having dinner, maybe you just like put those ideas together. Now that you are experienced and uh, the the queen of Berlin nightlife, oh my God, please <laughs> no. Oh. no! But you've you've made a great career for yourself. And what do you know now that you wish that you had known when you were just starting? Mm. That you can that you can share with someone who's just starting. This world, the world of music, or working in a in a in a, in, in electronic music uh, scene. Of course, it's a great, gives you a lot of retribution. Uh, you have a lot of party. You have a lot of wild nights. You meet a lot of interesting people. You wear cool clothes. But the most important thing is that if you are not getting the satisfaction from the moment you're making your music, then you're always going to feel empty, you know? And remember, May 15, I will be with Long Opus, Fata Kiefer, Joy Handsome, Hot Topic, Hot Topic, come to Schwartz again. <laughs>